member has said that we all went for a PG in State House, and it doesn't matter really uh, where the PG is held. It's neither here nor there. And but there was a party position. There was a party position, mm -hmm. and I <laughs> was one of the members of UDA party who voted no for the finance bill. So at the end of the day, it really narrows down to individual members of parliament and how you interact with your people and how you exercise your representation mandate. Mm -hmm. And I was representing the voices of the people of Kenya County because I had undertaken um, extensive consultation in regard to how they perceived the finance bill. And the president does not vote for any finance bill. The president does not sit in the National Assembly. And of course, it's such a tricky balancing act when there's a party position and when your people have um, expressly told you this is a way. And for me, I think it was um, an individual decision that if there's conflict of both, then the voice of the people, the voice of the people who sent me to parliament mm -hmm. remains supreme. And you know, Kenya, unfortunately, we vote along party lines. Mm -hmm. And um, for a long time, we vote along tribal lines. So we have parties that are popular in certain regions and popular in others. And you find that even if you're a good candidate and you're in the wrong party, then um, perhaps you don't make it to elective positions. So it is such a tough balancing act, like my brother has said. And it just breaks or narrows down to you as a person mm -hmm. and how you really want to exercise your representative role or mandate. Okay. Um, in regard to parliament, any um, citizen that wants to recall their MP is within their mandate. It's, it is their right, it is provided in the constitution and they have full protection and support from the constitution of Kenya. Mm -hmm. But what I would say and what I would stress on is that we have less than three years to the general election, um, I would urge them perhaps uh, it would be prudent to wait so that we don't disrupt even the delivery of um, services to Mwananchi. But if they really feel that they want to recall their member of parliament, it is within their right. It is also within their right to hold to account their members of parliament leading up to the 2027 election. So if they say they're not done with parliament, I mean, it is within their right to hold us. Okay.